Oh, oh. All right, now you can start. Hi, I'm Margaret Sermon, and in this tutorial, I'll show you how to unload the auto plate. Now, the first thing you need to do is you need to turn the handle. Now, depending on what's inside, you may see a lot of steam come out. That's completely normal. Uh, just to make sure you're not too close to it, because this is quite hot. First, you open the doors. Oh. Yeah, I need the card. Then we grab our card. And as I mentioned in the beginning tutorial on loading the autoplay, there's two types of handle. There's the inside handle here, and this releases the card from the autoplay machine. The second type of handle, if I push down on it, releases the cart from the rack. So what I need to do is I need to take these clamps right here and get them into these two spots right here to create a nice secure fit. Now what you can do is you can pull back on your cart to make sure this you have a secure fit. Once you have a secure fit, put your auto plate glove on and pull out the cart. Always make sure you have the auto plate glove on. This metal uh, has just been at about 121 degrees Celsius, so you don't want to put your hand onto it because you can burn yourself. Simply pull on the inside to release the cart from the auto plate. Close the auto plate door. Now leave it about three centimeters open. You want to completely close it, but you don't want to have it too much open. We can take our auto plate punts. Make sure you have the glove on when you pick up your auto plate. This stuff's just quite hot. You can set it aside. Grab the auto plate bin. And this one's dry from this run, but sometimes you might have liquid in it, so simply just rinse it off. Rinse it off, dump it, and store it back on the shelf. The cart goes under this spot right here, so make sure you put it back in the correct spot to not lock that door. And that is it for your tutorial on how to unload the autoplay.